with us on our last video, you will remember that Cindy, Becky, the resident, and her daughter started their investigation in the resident's bedroom where she saw a young man standing in her bedroom door. When we left the last video, Cindy had just did a knock to see if she could get a response from any entity present. Well, I'm going to knock. Maybe it would be easier for you to knock. Can you answer this for me? Okay, I heard it too. Yeah, I heard it that time too. Did y'all whisper at all? No. No. Mm -hmm. It's spark in there. Yeah, it's yeah, in there. I, I heard it and then there was nothing on it and no, uh, no water and no dishwasher. Mm -hmm. Why are you here? Can I help you? Well, it feels lighter in here. Yeah, I, I, I've always felt it felt a little thick. You notice when it stopped? Hmm? You notice when it stopped? When you tell them we don't believe that you're a little kid? Are you really a little kid? No. Um, are you a grown man? go. We'd like to get some answers. Oh, hello. Mm. Can you turn that off, please? Turn it off. We'll be nice to a little boy. We won't be nice to a grown man. Turn it off. I still want to know how old you are. Can you tell me that? Hear a bird? I hear it. I hear it. I hear it. And that little chirps. Yes, ma'am. I sometimes hear um, baby a baby crying sometimes. Hmm. That bear's <coughs> off, right? That bear's off. That fan. I'm cold right here. Are you standing over here beside me? Talk to us. Tell us who you are and what you're, you're doing here. I know. I'm going to ask a different question. I want, to, I want you to answer for me. Are you a nice person? Thank you. <laughs> Can you turn it off now? Almost. Back away from it. There you Thank go. Thank you. Can I ask something? Go ahead. Are you lying to us? I don't believe you. If you're a little kid, make one of the, those green lights go up to red or orange. Let's 
so I'll pull up on something over there. Something like flashlight? Maybe that's what the little kid thought you meant. It is an AM FM radio. We're taking the scanning me mechanism out so it will continually scan through all the radio uh -huh. stations and uses uh, white noise. Okay, we're going to use this and it's noisy, but maybe you can talk to us through it. Will you try? Are you really a little boy? Are there other children here with you? Do you hear what's going on in it? What? what? Uh, Spanish speaking? I hear it. Spanish station. Maybe they don't understand English. ¿Qué pasa? <laughs> I thought I heard who's a jerk. Yeah. yeah. Then I heard Mike. <laughs> Mike? Is Mike a jerk? No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Do you know my name? You seem to know Mike's name. Has there been a Ouija board played in this house before? My problem is you see, the shit I heard yes I did and then I heard house. So is that where you came from? You know, we never, uh, we haven't had those Spanish stations come through before, have we? I don't remember them. I don't either. Uh -uh. At all. Not, at least not like, no. if there were, there might have been more or something. Yeah. yeah, but these are more all throughout. Are you a 19-year-old boy? <laughs> Yeah, I said yes. So you're 19. Why? So, turn off the flashlight if that's true. What if we said we don't believe you? <laughs> Why were you holding a knife? <laughs> Are you the boy that was here in the bedroom that day that scared me? The boy, the one who pushed her down. That's how we We're going to leave now. Is that all right? You're not talking much. 
Do you plan on staying here with us? Do you want us to leave? Is there someone in this house that you're afraid of? Well, tell us bye. When you're looking for the one store you can trust to have the exact battery you need right when you need it, whether it's for your car, riding mower, motorcycle, laptop, smartphone, watch, plus light bulbs for lamps, floodlights, can lights, appliances, all topped off by helpful experts, it's easy to see why nobody else stacks up to batteries plus bulbs. Did I mention we also repair smartphones? Batteries plus bulbs. Trust the plus. Gizmo Blue has the largest selection of paintball guns and accessories. It's the only store that has its own feel. So call them to plan your next party or event. They have the largest selection of airsoft guns in Central Texas. They also carry a largest arc of martial arts weapons, swords, and knives. Ghost! We have the largest selection of ghost tech equipment in Central Texas. Gizmo Blue, 3302 Franklin Avenue, Waco, Texas. This is Joey and Elizabeth. We're back in the daughter's bedroom. Mike's on the camera. Um, so we're going to ask some questions, see if we can get some responses. Uh, is there anyone here that would like to talk to us? You can touch the red glowing light. You can touch any one of the, the, the little green lights. Let us know that you're here. Why are you here? You can tell us in one of the recorders. We know that you're here in this house. Can you tell us how you came to be here? Someone bring you? You can tell us in the recorder. Talk to the little red light. Did you follow Brenda from her previous residence to this place? Why are you hurting Brenda in particular? Okay, two this one off. What are you? Went off again. Are you human? How long have you been in this house? Are you afraid of us? Has the baby seen you? Is someone holding you here?
Do you like to stand in the doorways and watch what's going on in this house? Have you attached yourself to Brenda? Are you causing her harm? Who sent you here? Are you too afraid to ask, answer our questions? I wouldn't think something like you would be afraid of anything. Were you here before this house was built? Were you brought here by someone or something? Do you use the mirror in this room right down the hall? Have you seen other spirits use the mirror? Brenda's been feeling um, scared. She has been uh, poked and bruised, and her health has been declining. Is that because of what you've been doing to her? Did you shove her back into the bed that day twice? trying to suck the life out of her? Did you crawl out from under the bed and <laughs> lay on top of Brenda's daughter in this room? Hey. I heard that knocking. What was that? It's on the, side of, on the side of this wall. I heard it too. Were you just toying with Cindy and her team? don't want to answer the tough questions? How many entities are in this house? Did you hear that? They hear whispers in this house. Who are you whispering to? They're one dominant that takes control over the other entities. Do you hate this family? Okay, I'm getting a cool breeze. I, I don't feel it. You feel it? It might be over here by him. It's, it feels like it's getting a lot cooler. Are you standing next to Mike? Just watching from the doorway because you want to have an escape route? Somebody come over here. I feel. I just want you to verify. Right here. You feel it? This is where the cold is coming from. Are you going to harm the baby? Are you the person that turned the cross upside down? Do you do that to scare this family? Are you moving things that Brenda's daughter sets down to confuse her? Do 
You see the blip? I saw it. Do you want this family to leave this house? If they do leave the house, will you just follow? Do you focus on Brenda because she's weak? Does someone send you here? Did a member of this family summon you here? Did someone from the church bring you here? Did you come via some seance or Ouija board practice? Are you connected to a cemetery somehow? Did you just knock on the wall? Answer this knock. trying to not let us validate you, aren't you? You know you can't hide from, from me. I know you're here. Why don't you just go ahead and let it touch one of these devices so the other people here know that you're here? Why are you tormenting this family? I want to know who sent you here. Hopefully we got something on the recorders, maybe something. We didn't get a whole lot of validation, obviously. So, signing off. See the, the, how the different in temperature? Yeah. This could be a portal in this room, this closet. Right I even here. got across my fingertips that team. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I touched so on this this side of the of the closet. I I think before we leave, we need to do something there, just to be on the safe side. I'm kind of glad that she's not here. Right now. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um. Movement above us. Um, I hear walking, like people walking, and not just in this room, but throughout the entire house above us. Oh, God. Okay. Um, I think. Hmm. 
The right there? Yeah, I yeah. think there's something that's actually on the ceiling. Uh-huh, and it's right here. Yeah, and it's, uh, you can't see it right now, but no. I think there's something above us watching us on the ceiling. And uh, it goes, it goes into the attic and comes back out through the ceiling. Does it mark anything? No, it's no. not like, it isn't, okay. I, I can't see it, but I know it's there. Um, he feels warm. He's hot. Yeah, it's 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 not human. Whatever it like, is. I just started sweating. It's it, yeah. Okay. They that's, were uh, they were sweating in there. That's yeah. not good. Um, that's what was. So that's a pressing feeling I have. In, I'm having on my head. Yeah, it's right above you. Yeah, he's not nice. Mm. You feel like it's a he? Oh yeah. He's choky. Oh, it gets around it crawls through the ceiling. Oh, oh that's heavy. <clears throat> wow. Definitely being watched in this room. Yeah. Um, I don't know who sleeps in here, but uh, it's, yeah, you're definitely being watched at night. Um, I believe a lot of bumps in the night go on in here. Um, maybe even being touched. Um, I don't know if they're being scratched or, yeah. but whatever it is, it's it's targeting the person that sleeps in. One of the, I don't know, is it just one person that sleeps in here or two? Okay, some beings being targeted in here. Um, There's a dog under there. She's, oh no, I'm just thinking. I'm just there is one under there. She's just terrified of that. Okay. Right. <laughs> I, I, I could feel That's something, but I wasn't yeah. sure what it was. Um, I don't even get to pet her. <laughs> I think this thing that's coming through the ceiling um, is coming and it, it's like it, it's coming and it's just hovering right over it's the so people in the bed. Yeah, and it's Almost like it's sucking the life right out of them. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's like thin. I can feel him. Yeah. Just so um, I would be very concerned for the people in this room um, because it doesn't like these people here. It wants them out. Well, this was out of this house. Doctors. I think they. I think that the man knows that they're onto him and that he doesn't like. It. See the, the, how the different in temperature? Yeah. This could be a portal in this room. Are you experiencing any unexplainable noises or activity in your home or office? Or do you know someone who does? Please contact us at 254 749 Five eight three nine, or you can email us at mcpi at live dot com.